Hello, it is January 20th, still an inauguration day. It's kind of late in the day. I'm going to do a reading for the party claiming to be the new president. Is that so? Let's see. What do the cards have to say about Biden claiming to be duly elected official? Will there be any consequences to this? It already looks like there was some consequences. He didn't take in a military plane. Did they not want to bring him to the, the White House? Barbed wire around the Capitol and the White House keeps people from getting out. Not people from getting in. That's rather strange. Hmm. Do we have an internal civil war between the military and the FBI? Possibly. And CIA? Other governments backing these different parties? Funds? Drug running? So we know drug running has happened. I ran Contra under Reagan to get black budget, black ops budget money. Do you think that was the first time? Ah, uh, no. Last time? Mm, no. Time they got caught. So it's probably like maybe that was all about Vietnam was about their drugs. Afghanistan, as soon as they went in, they started growing poppies again. The Taliban had that under control. Under the Taliban, they were not... Oh, I got them all mixed up. We're going to have some upside-down ones, peeps. Um, under the, the Taliban had that all under control. There was no poppies, no heroin being made. That wasn't good. That wasn't a good for America. That wasn't good for the deep state. No money. So, then we have the cartels in Mexico and the gun running that President Jr., Bush Jr. had. He started it. Running guns down to the cartels in Mexico. And then Obama put it on steroids. Fast and Furious. Go look it up. And that was taking and giving them unserialized guns to the cartel. They thought that was a good idea. <laughs> oh, brilliant. Brilliant, brilliant. Well, it's brilliant if you CIA are us. They are a cartel. They're one of them. So we have to understand... Those things are happening before our eyes. Drugs and people. So how could you stop it? Hmm. Cut. So, let's see. This administration duly claimed to be duly certified all's good, no problems with interference from Iran or Italy, no problems from the machines. We always get negative voting, you know, 100 people to go to vote, one party's got to get a negative 50 party they don't want. Look into that. Decremental counting and the Dominion machines. Not good. Okay, so this administration's claim to be legitimate. And what will happen? Okay, let's go.
on the bottom is the Nine of Wands. Be on the defensive. Prepare for an assault. Keep resources in reserve. It'll be surrounded by trouble. You will feel emotionally and physically tired from the constant conflict and setbacks. No easy answers, but inner strength, perseverance will get you through. Okay. They're on the defensive already. And the first card is the Page of Pentacles. So they're happy right now, I suppose. And they probably have some people serving them that are like clueless. Young people, like, you know, Hitler Youth or something. They just don't know. They're just ignorant. And then what's crossing them, the current influences are inspiration, insight, and hope. Dreams for future will come true. So that's what crosses them. So that's who may be, be their trouble. And the third card which is the gold card, it's upside down. Um, unemotional, a sensual person who stresses the physical side of life, worldly and jaded. Life holds no surprises for this person, attractive and well-dressed. He might deceive you, if not as he appears. Do not trust this man with your heart. He'll break it. Do not trust him with your heart. He'll break it. Okay, and then the fourth card. Influence of distant past. Another reverse card. Somebody has emotional problems. They can't commit. No discipline. Angers easily. Brash, cocky attitude. Appear successful, but he is an act. Keep dark secrets. Can be extremely cruel and abusive. Promises a relationship, but will never have, but will never leave after he gets what he wants. Charming, but superficial. Um, yeah, and I don't think everybody got to look into the investigation of Biden's activity with his son. They even flew to... Um, the Ukraine together when Hunter was on the board of that energy company. They made billions of dollars, people. Come on. He claims that he had no idea what his son was doing, and they took plane trips together when he was on the board of this company. I mean, just chit-chat with your friend. You would know a whole heck of a lot, let alone with your parent. However, if they were in on it together in private, they would say publicly, let's not talk. Anyway, so, and have you seen the video of how quick to anger Joe Biden is? He is not a nice person behind the scenes. He is not. And Kamala Harris, she won't even speak. She just puts up her hand. They're going to be, they want to be treated like some kind of new royalty. Mm -mm, I'm sorry, that's just not going to happen. We're not going to bow down, kiss your ring, or whatever little things you think you should have to do <laughs> for the selected. I'm not even going to call them the elected. They were the selected. Selected by China. <laughs> Thanks to the China virus. Okay, so four and number five, which would be the recent past events this reading it's the world card and it says you will enter a period of great happiness so in the recent past events I'm sure the presidency made them really really happy goals are achieved all their plans worked out all worked out Pieces fall into place. Goals are achieved. Unexpected sums of money come your way. Yeah, I think you got a bunch of money from um, big tech for inauguration that didn't happen. You know, a party. 
kind of just like money laundering and exchanging hands with that and with bank settlements and stuff. That's just crazy. I mean, we didn't even get our two hours on the Senate floor like Walmart said we would. Anyway, so I'm sure they're really hap happy. Possible <clears throat> change of residence or job, sense of fulfillment and inner peace from helping the less fortunate. What you give will be returned to you many times over. So I like that, uh, what President Trump said about the 25th Amendment. Be careful. It's going to be used against you. And it could. I, you know, chatter is that they do have all the evidence they need that there was um, influence in our elections. So there was interference via the voting machines and software or other irregularities and people and whoever helped fund buying the machines for these swing states. They say they have reports already done and known, so could be short-lived happiness, and what they give will be given back. So we've seen what the four years we've had of constant orange man bad, Russian collusion, which was BS, and spying on BS information just to, you know, Put our attention somewhere else rather than on the actual facts of the matter of Hillary and her server and other facts about China, and Hunter and Joe. So, you know, we have to see that for what it is. And um, I don't think they like the fact that so many of us know what's going on and want things to be different. And we're not looking for them like when Facebook or whoever puts... <coughs> fact checkers in place like who are they the gatekeepers of truth i don't think so when they say the states have went through those things and fixed everything uh no if they can't do a ballot audit nothing happened we don't know if we can't do a machine audit there's a problem machine and ballot audits should have happened they have security on them like a dollar bill we'll know if they're a valid ballot or not so what is wrong with that? What is wrong with some the guy that uh, invented the QR code? He said all he has to do is scan all of them. He can on the mail-in ones he can tell if they've been folded, if they've been touched by humans, how many times, if it's the right paperweight, if it's the right paper, all by a machine. So within a day he could go through all of them. He said that's pretty interesting. But they don't want to do that. They protest this too much. And they have to then, after they've had four years of claiming an illegitimate president with really no proof, then they turn it around but have to shut us up, have to kick us off social media where they can have their fuck Trump groups, excuse the language, the F fuck OF. <laughs> Trump groups. Did we stop them? No. Did anybody stop them? Did the president stop them? No. But they want to use their offices of power to stop people. And their tech influence. See, the techs don't, big tech doesn't want to be censored. They want to keep going like they are. They don't want to be broken up and um, lose any market share. So they're kowtowing to people they think will give them what they want. Continue with their CO2, 3, or whatever it is that allows them not to um, have to be a public utility. So that one could be good or bad, but it's they're probably pretty happy that it all went through. And then six is um, future influences. What do we have for future? We have the heart upside down. It's the three of swords. I don't like this card. Um, someone protects your feelings instead of telling the truth one person in the relationship will be tempted to betray the other flaws in a relationship are overlooked because the positive aspects are worth keeping contented and happy with the relationship you see no need to change anything 
So that is the future, um, future influences. So, and their feelings, his feelings and his political um, persona are, was protected all through the, all through the election cycle. And that was an influence, had an influence on our election. They knew Hunter had billions of dollars of contracts with an energy company as a board of director, which he knew nothing about energy. And there's phone calls and recorded uh, documents that show that they were doing this because Joe Biden had a position. And that's why they're getting this position, too. That's why Biden has this position, is he... He played with China and Russia. He gave, you know, it's it's wrong. And hopefully it'll be, you know, investigated. I hope they can't just cheat and become president. And then it all gets buried under the rug. But anyway, that was buried by the press. Um, something has to happen with the press. I don't know what charges can go against them for their complicity and all this it's definitely like a gaslighting thing where you're like okay I see with my own eyes I'm not brainwashed I'm not into any kind of a Trump cult it's like freaking crazy what they're saying it's like okay they're painting a picture for people that isn't true stereotyping people labeling people to get them to hate them. You can see how they, you know, in Nazi Germany, they, they, did, they did this to the Jews. And this allowed them to kick people out of their houses, put them in camps, because they needed re-education. They needed, they needed help. <laughs> yeah, uh-huh, sure. All right, so then we have, that is the future influences. And then the present attitude is, okay, the magician, so... I'm sure they have this all under control. Science and high tech, well suited for that. You're a risk taker, an overachiever, highly organized, and tremendous powers of concentration. You're flexible and creative. Determination and the strength of your personality will overcome problems, take charge, and take action. The card of personal power. Well, that's the present attitude. Does he really have any personal power? Did he use that last walk? He was lost. He didn't know where he was. He couldn't pick up a notebook. That was sad. And eight, environmental influences. Is the fat guy. He always reminds me like he's going to be dancing and kicking some kind of Russian dancer or something. It says here that um, environmental influences are wishes and hopes go unfulfilled problems remain unresolved you're unhappy and restless difficulty with physical intimacy lovers drift apart eating and drinking in excess possibly robbery or theft of possessions someone cheats you out of money what goes around comes around. Didn't we say that here? In this card, it says, whatever you give will be returned to you many times over. If you gave bullshit, you're going to get bullshit. So it doesn't look like the environment's going to be happy. And then innermost emotions... The Seven of Wands. You are on the defensive. You have the advantage and will eventually win. Be strong and aggressive. Expect criticism and challenges in your authority. Stand up for yourself and for your ideas. You will never regret your actions, even though they may seem too aggressive at the time. People compete for your energy and resources. Okay, so that's interesting. You're on the defensive, but what will the outcome be? You might win some wars, but what would the outcome of the battle be? We have the Three of Wands. It's reversed. 
three of wands reversed. It says bad advice, rejection of your ideas and dreams by others, decisions made too hastily, unsound business judgment, bad luck, sneaks up on you, you sneaks up on you unexpectedly. Money or investments may be lost. Withdraw from important arguments. Save your strength and energy for the most crucial battles. So this doesn't look good for this administration. Give what you get. So whatever karma he has coming to him is going to come. Very powerfully, so... From what I've seen of his past, it's not that great. And from what I've seen, how he acted once he was nominated, how he just snapped at reporters and was just an ass, to tell you the truth. Not kind at all to the little people, <laughs> put in quotes. So that's my reading. If you have any comments or suggestions, um, please comment below. I'm new to this and just started, but find it really interesting to see what the cards say. My emotions say one thing and my mind says one thing, but the cards can say, um, you know, something totally different. So I thought this was a pretty interesting reading and hopefully we can see what's going to happen. I don't know when the National Guard's going to leave because, you know, the the actions of a few bad players, and there were just a few bad players. There was a bunch that the capital would not be here. People would be dead. More than just one innocent person shot. So, let's just hang in there and, you know, just wake up. We have, sw you know, globalists. I Swamp creatures, just globalists. You know, you have to look at it like that. They're not for America first. They're not for us being energy independent. This is the first time in 70 years we're actually selling energy and we're energy dependent under Trump. You know, the, the energy is going to be sold and it's going to be tapped and, you know, possibly we'll run out. And when that happens, we'll have to deal. But until then, if we don't extract it and sell it, somebody else is going to. In fact, they might extract it, ship it off to China, have them refine it, and then send it back here. I am serious. That's how crazy these things are getting. And with the economics, if, if they cared about the environment, stop making the crap. Stop making the crap plastics. Stop making the pla crap metals. They just are a waste. Within a year, the product's gone. Within five years, their plastic breaks up. I mean, it can't even last five years. So the plastics I have now, I try to get like 90s before, you know, China started making the plastics in America. So we need manufacturing here because it's bad for the environment. When all the, the raw products are shipped there, that takes energy. Then they make the stuff and then they ship it back. Those boats and airplanes going over there may be cheap for them, but it's not cheap for the environment. There's a cost to that. And we also have to look at like our, the corporate welfare that we've had going on. There's just so many people who work at these big corporations like Walmart and Amazon that cannot even, you know, make a living. So they got to get on food stamps. They have to get on um, public uh Medical plans, that is public welfare, I mean corporate welfare, because these companies do make enough money, but instead they pay their CEOs way too much money while our country is struggling. It just does, you know, it just doesn't make sense that all this money is being hoarded at the top. All the wealth that is created by the people's work is being hoarded. So... Hopefully things can get better. Blessings to everybody who's listening. Just hang in there. God willing, this will, will get through all of this. And it won't be too damaging to the republic. 
Um, I just pray that those barbed wires pointing in are an indication, and Joe Biden not taking a military plane are an indication that our military could stop this administration. Not, not President Trump, just our military has a constitutional duty if they know of foreign influences in the election and that these parties are not duly elected or certified. There was fraud involved. So we'll see. Over and out. Just hang in there.